welcome back to the Tia channel. Okay, thank you so much for the subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Because I know you guys don't have to subscribe. You don't have to watch, but you do. So thank you. Okay, let's get into it. The reason why I am reading the household bios is because we have reached the 30 year marker in my custom hood, which I love. <laughs> okay, so in this playthrough, we are playing with Fidel King. He lives on DK 511 Pickett Drive and his net worth is 13,794 simoleons. That does not include his bank account. And his household bio says, Mr. King is loved by all and has loved plenty. He just wants to live a fun life, but he has had some bumps in the road. He has had to slow down his fast paced life to become more practical for his girls but can he bring his family together keep his lifestyle and his sanity or is that too much to ask yeah i mean if you're new here you don't really know what is going on but it's a lot going on with fidel king you would have to go and watch the playlist to understand a couple of things that's happening but we're gonna go ahead get into his house and i will see you guys we are here in fadil king's home and fadil is sleeping on his couch we will talk about why he's sleeping on his couch but for now look at him oh. now he's a ballroom dancer he's really getting high in his career and the last time that we played him he got a promotion which he needs okay he he needs the simoleons okay <laughs> it's the truth it's the truth. We all know it. Or if you're new here, you're going to learn why. Anyways, this is Fadil King. He becomes an elder in 11 days. He is a pleasure sim. His LTW is to have 50 dream dates. So all you have to do is just kind of keep going on dates, making sure that they are dream dates. And bam, like that's it. That's, that's all it is to it. So he wants to ask us him on a date which will be the very first thing that we will be doing and he wants to tell a joke to his oldest daughter oh he loves fadiah he wants to tell an inside joke to his baby he wants to buy a vacation home and he wants to have a party he fears the death of sabrina that is fadiah's mom the death of unity which is interesting and anything happening to fatima which is sabrina's cat so as you can see, he is very close with his first baby mama and, like, all of them. But, I mean, you know, their baby, like, his baby that he has for Sabrina, she is the eldest out of all of his children. So, he has spent more time with Sabrina. You know what I mean? Like, he has. Like, it's, <sighs> I don't know. Okay, anyways, okay. He is in the dance career. This is not base game. What does this come with? <laughs> oh, seasons. It comes with seasons. He is a ballroom dancer and he makes 1,380 simoleons. And I know, like, looking at his place, you'd be like, he makes all of these simoleons. Like, what's going on? <laughs> like, like, why doesn't he have any simoleons for himself? It's hard for him to keep simoleons when he has to pay it out for child support. So, you know, there, there's that. There's that. But he has a pretty good reputation. His reputation level is prominent personality. And he is an Aries, if you have forgotten. Here is his bio. Fadil is a girl dad, and he loves it. He is still able to live his best life and go on all the dream dates that his heart desires. However, Fidel is struggling financially. He has three daughters. Will he be more cautious with his lovers or will he add more baby mamas to his roster and checkbook? So yeah, it's been a lot. Um, it is good that he is a pleasure sim, so he finds the pleasures in the little things in life. Like spending time with people and spending time with someone that's not a little thing in life but it's good that he finds pleasure in like the simple things he finds pleasure in just living and being alive and it's not so much on oh my gosh we need to focus on being successful we need to get to this point in our lives it's like no let's let's enjoy life that's that's what i love about pleasure sims they're very down to earth 
and they bring you back to reality. Anyways, so his hobby is music and dance. His sub hobby is playing the piano, which he hasn't been able to do because, you know, he can't afford one right now. He just can't, you guys. He can't. He can't really afford a piano at the moment. Okay. So the last memory that we looked at for Fidel was that Fantasia got an A plus report card, which is very good. We love that for our baby. <laughs> and then he got a promotion, which I was just telling you about now. He made best friends with Taraya. That is currently the last baby girl. Okay. <laughs> Currently, that is his last baby, last baby girl, you know. He has 10 best friends, and he met Marie Rosher, who was an NPC. I think he met Marie, so I was playing Ephraim Ingram, and if you go and watch Ephraim Ingram's episode, Fadil is out, and that's where he, I think that's where he met Marie, because at one point, Fadil was like in a hot tub, so I think that's where he met Marie. Y'all, this is like one of those <laughs> slim points where I just remember <laughs> what happened. Because I have so many Sims now. It's like, oh, I don't, I don't remember. And I don't force myself. I'm like, oh, if I don't remember, I don't remember. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um. Mm, okay. So here's Hakan Olsen. They are enemies, but they're also like um, family. They're kind of related through Fadil's second baby mama. Um, and yeah, you know, Hakan is probably here. That's why his, like, you know, icon is right here before all of these other Sims. <sighs> yeah, yeah, it's, it's not good. They, they fight all the time. If I remember correctly, they were fighting at Zabrina's birthday party when Zabrina aged into an elder entered her golden age her golden stage of life they were fighting at her party so i was like okay this is not good oh and if you want to see that just go and watch zabrina just the baker family just go and watch the baker family's most recent episode and you will be able to see that but yeah he's probably here knocking over a trash can or stealing some newspaper you know you know the huge the huge Okay, so like I have explained before, this is the family only relationship panel. It won't include his baby mamas because he's like he has never been married to them, and even then he's not currently married or anything like that. So here are his children. This is Fadaya, she is the eldest daughter, and then you have Fantasia, this is the middle child, and then you have Taraya Nelson. Okay, so I'm gonna go to his family tree. Okay, as you can see, this is the family tree of Fadil King, Fadaya Baker. She is black. Both of her parents are black. Fantasia is mixed. She is also known as like Bladev. Like they call her Bladev in the family. Basically, it just means that she's mixed with black and Native American. And, you know, Fadil is black. So her mom has to be Native American. And then his, well, as far as we know, this is his last start. I don't, you know, I don't know if he, y'all, he better not. Oh my gosh. Anyways. Okay, the last baby that's on the family tree is Taraya Nelson, and Taraya, she is fully black as well. So yeah, we have discussed absolutely everything that is occurring right now. Um, I'm going to wake him up. So the last time we were here, as you can see, like we have this table. We had to buy this table because it was Sunday. So Sunday is family day where all of my sims, they come together. They like invite all of their family over, they come together, they talk, they commune, they chat. And yeah, they try to have a really good time as a family. So that's why I like this huge table is here with all these chairs. And then I had to buy him a new bed because Amani was invited over. That is Tahira's cat. Tahira is baby mama number three. Tariah's mom. I know, I know. You just, you got to go back through the playlist so you can keep up. But um, Amani, she destroyed his bed. When he went to work, she destroyed his bed. So, yeah, I had to go and buy him a new bed, and that's exactly what I did. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wake him up. I'm going to have him take, well, well, yeah, okay. I'm going to have him take a bath, and then he's going to go to sleep. 
Oh my gosh. Okay, so let's go ahead and play. I've discussed absolutely everything with you guys. But damn, what's up? I think he heard us talking to him. Anyways, okay. So I'm going to have him sleep. He's thinking about that promotion as he should. Y'all, look at the trash can out here. Okay. I'm going to speed past it because right now he is just taking a bath. He's not really doing anything right now. Um, I do know. Well, okay. We can keep speeding past. I am aware that he does need skills. Oh, it's broken. Okay. He'll fix that. Oh, he only has one. It's fine. He'll still fix it. I am aware that he does need skills, but the way that I play my game is want-based. So, his aspiration meter is not in the gold, nor is it in the platinum. It's in the green. So, I make them happy first, like in the gold or platinum. And once I do that, then I can focus on what they need for their career. But I like to focus on them being happy unless they're, they have like a family or like a child or something like that. If they have that it's harder for me to focus on what they want versus like what the child needs and wants anyways okay the deal is going to get some much needed sleep he had a long day yesterday <laughs> and if you don't know just go back and watch the last episode he's gonna go ahead and go to sleep when he wakes up then i will see you guys the deal is waking up and he wants to gain a skill point talk to someone about his hobby and wants to and play with someone okay you guys normally normally he's not too focused on doing any of that i did have to sell some of his um dream date plants because he needs to have at least 600 simoleons in his actual household funds like on pocket like on hand because of child support like it comes out as often like it comes out often so and he has three children, so it's usually 200 simoleons charged per child. So that's why I have it that way. Okay, he's going to invite Sabrina over. Yes. No, just me, Sabrina. Just me, just me. He don't want nobody else but you. She's like, yeah, I'll come over. It's nobody else but you only you no one else no one else only you to myself he don't need nobody else nobody else okay yeah pick that up please sabrina oh sabrina even in your golden years you are still as beautiful as ever Come greet Sabrina. It looked like she was gonna walk back there anyway, but you know. Oh, oh. She's like the deal. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love to see that he is still very much attracted to Sabrina after all this time. I'm thinking about, oh, I thought he was thinking about Hakan. He's thinking about Marissa. Yeah. Ugh, Marissa. Ugh. Um, ask on a date. He knows he can have a dream date with Sabrina. Always and forever more. Um... He's like, you want to go on a date? Here at the place? You know what we do? Okay. They're going to get started with their date. He's going to entertain her. She wants to talk. I guess y'all can gossip a little bit. <laughs> okay, you wanna play? Who are you gossiping about? <laughs> Lost best friend food. Salvador. Oh man, was that like Damien? I don't know. <laughs> okay, she wants to dance. Uh, 
Okay, let's do slow dance. Oh, Is it no? You guys are getting older, you know. He's like you're still beautiful. Whoa. Fall in love with Salvadora. Hmm. My oh my. Should I lock that in? You guys, they don't even have any other wants for each other. Like, this is it. Mm. But it's okay, because he doesn't need anyone else but you. Only you, Zabrina. Right now, I mean, because he wants to fall in love with a sim. Oh, it's Sierra? <laughs> okay. Well, um... And then... Oh, be squeezed. Okay, yeah. Let her squeeze you. He's like Sabrina. <laughs> uh, ask her, do you like what you see? Looks like he got over Salvador very quickly. She's like, you're all muscular and toned. What is this? Get a back rub, be flirted with. Okay. Let's flirt. Goose. And then do a back rub. This is what they do. He don't need nobody else but you. Nobody else. Oh, oh my gosh, his face. Oh my gosh, y'all. I can't. Where y'all going? It's her heels that's making her like taller than him. Oh, he wants to boo-boo. Already? Okay, well, we're going to keep the one locked in for... Have a dream date. Okay, get it. Oh, he did flirt with her. I think her wants may be stuck. They may be stuck. Okay. Casual. Wherever y'all want to woo. -woo oh, y'all picking the couch? Okay, they have one underwear. Wish Komada Plankaton. Yo, that's his baby mama, his first baby mama. Baby mama number one. You don't want nobody else but her. Period. Okay, so I am having the muhu because that's what he wants, even though it's not really in her want panel. It's something going on with her want panel because this should have rerolled. Kids from the Instagram well, game. Anything else? What are y'all doing? Okay, they're woohooing. Great. And now they're going to have a dream date. And I think he's going to... I'm going to let them kind of do whatever they want for maybe... Like a little while. Oh, okay, now it's rolling. Oh, it looks like y'all want to keep going. Y'all know, when it comes to these two, they literally cannot stay away from each other. It's insane. That's how Fadai, I know that's what you want. You guys, this is how Fadai was born, you know? Exactly this way. Hug, okay. She wants the woohoo in the bed now. So let's see what Fadil wants. If Fadil wants to do that, then we'll do it. Oh, okay. Well, never mind. <laughs> What's this? Flirt. Okay. Um, let's woohoo in the bed then. This is what they do, you guys. They get on this date, and then they just they just can't stay away from each other, like. 
Sabrina has always been that one for him. She just has, even though he's thinking about Salvador. He is definitely thinking about Salvador. But we're gonna, we're gonna leave them alone. What is this? Okay, they're gonna make out again first. Oh, it's Makoto. Hey, Makoto. Oh, you're leaving? Okay, all right. See you later, Makoto. <laughs> What is this casual woohoo? Okay. Yeah, this is what they do. Sabrina knows. She can get what she need and or want from for deal. Oh, they want to keep going. Yeah, I'm going to let them keep going. They usually tire themselves out this way. The attraction. I know, I know it. Okay, let's hug romantic. You know, for some people, they're like so in love with each other. They really are. They're like so in love with each other that they cannot stay away. They can't stay away from each other. They would rather always be together. Like, it's crazy. Okay. Let's flirt, caress. Cause she looks like she wants a little more, but we don't know yet. Ooh! Get married to Sakari? <laughs> oh my gosh! <gasps> wow! What? <laughs> Whoa! Okay, he wants to fall in love with Zabadora. And get married to Sakari. Sakari? I think that's it for this date. Um, he obviously has other things on his mind. <laughs> Not you making her catch you. Oh, there's Osamu. I already know. Okay, let's um, let's end the date. And why not greet Osamu? I mean, why not? Here he is, Osamu Evans. He is one of my newer sims. And then look at that—he wants to go on another date. Of course you do. But he might as well greet Osamu, because Osamu is here. Why not? Yeah. And then he's going to go in the bathroom. <laughs> he's like, that lady is pretty. Osamu, do you have to use the bathroom? Because Fadil is in there. Can you get out, please? Thank you. So I guess he's gonna go talk to Sabrina. I'd like to show you guys without... Oh, she's doing his lawn, okay. She was like, we had such a good day, I might as well help you out a little bit. <laughs> yeah, the bed is the best. Oh my gosh, I literally can't. He's neat, right? You are neat. I think Osamu has to use the bathroom. Yeah. But he really needs to clean his bathroom and repair uh, his toilet. Uh, uh, no, keep repairing, my guy. You can do it. Well, at least he met Osamu. Uh, How do you feel about uh, Osamu? Uh, Oh, okay. He likes Osamu. He likes him. Oh, they're talking. Okay, because Osamu is attracted to Sabrina. My, oh, my. The things that happen in this neighborhood is crazy. Oh, 
Dude, are you Look almost done? Yeah. Okay, he is. Great. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's let's leave. I think that's one of Sabrina's lovers. I don't know. Probably not. Why is it? Yeah, he's on the toilet. I didn't know homeboy was gonna be on the toilet just like that. Okay, anyways. Okay, he needs charisma body, all of that. Okay. We're gonna have him write his novel. Cause he just has so many adventures, literally. Look at Osamu, he's just sitting here. <laughs> oh, you guys, my newest sim. But yeah, Fadil, he don't want nobody else but you, even though he's thinking about marrying a romance sim. That was the only reason why I didn't lock that in, cause Sakari would never. Now, if it was Albedora, you know, maybe I could possibly lock that in and we kind of see what happens, but you guys, that would have to happen. Like on a on a whim whim. What's going on out here? We're speeding past this because you know he's just oh Chakwell. He is best friends with Chakwell. It was Chakwell and Andres. Okay, there's another sim. They are just getting along and talking. We love to see it. Are you almost done? He's not. He's nowhere near done. Oh, they're just talking away. Okay. What was that? Oh my gosh, what's going on? Why is he standing in front of her while she's sitting down? Oh, tickling? Already? Oh my. Okay, now they're hanging out. Oh my gosh. What's going on? I don't even know. Okay, um, mm, okay. I need to do his child support stuff. I'm gonna go do that and then I will be right back. So I was trying to send off like child support stuff. The computer broke. So he's gonna have to call a repairman. And then I'm going to have him come get some leftovers. Now, the real dilemma... The, okay, here's the real dilemma. The real dilemma is that he only has 345 simoleons in his household. Funds, which isn't... That's not good. Uh, where is the repairman? Yes. Because he doesn't have enough mechanical skills to fix it, so. Yes, we would like you to come out, please. Thank you. So I think I am going to have to delete. Well, I mean, not delete. I'm going to have to sell some of these flowers. Just to make sure that when they take the money from him. <laughs> Think about Sabrina. That they're able to appropriately get the money. Now, Monique's hack computer, they're good about that. Oh, he's talking to them. I love when they do this. Monique's hack computer is good about this where if the money does come out, it'll also come out of his bills. Like it'll charge his bills for it because it was it was back pay basically. <laughs> So as you can see, even though he makes a bunch of simoleons, it's, it's kind of like it's almost not enough for all of the children that he has. Uh, it's, it's a lot. It really is. It's a lot. But, you know, this is where we are. This is where we are. And he is just talking to them. This is crazy. Okay, how do you feel about them? Okay. He could never feel terribly about. Oh, look. 
I can't. Okay, can we put the walls up? Okay. A little, a little. Can we? Okay, there we go. Okay. So he is talking to Sabrina and Osamu. So he did have a really good time on his date with Sabrina. Had a dream date. Of course, they always have a dream date. The only time they didn't have a dream date was when Sabrina was pregnant. I remember that. Because that's when she was pregnant. And he was like, what's wrong? Like, they got into it as well. Like, I think they started arguing because she just, she wasn't okay. But it was because she was pregnant with his baby. And that's when Fadaya was born. But anyways. So, yeah. This is a very interesting. Everything that is happening and transpiring. Hopefully, after he gets his computer fixed, we will be able to do what he needs to do concerning, like, the child support stuff, y'all. I just can't. <laughs> I just can't. It's so much. But it's okay. It's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. But anyways, thank you guys so much for tuning in to Fadil King's life and everything that he has to deal with being Fadil King himself oh you guys this is perfect look at him being Fadil King himself and I guess I guess I'll see you guys later